everybody, and welcome to the latest episode of the Casually Avid Gamer Plays Minecraft. I'm really glad you guys are here. And let's talk about what's going to go on today. Okay, my mouse just died. There we go. It wasn't working. That was weird. So weird. Anyway, you, you see that place way back there in the distance that we haven't been to in forever? We're working in there today. I finally decided I've had it with the designer's block. I am doing something with that quarter of the, the monastery library. I'm doing something with it. I don't know if we'll get it done today because we're going to be really short on time, but I'm at least starting something. But before we do that, you'll notice that I still have a chain helmet on. And it's it's... Not just any chain helmet. It's the chain helmet of derpitude. Back when we had made, or when I built my new enchanting station, and it looks awesome, still looks awesome, love it, we're about to see it. I fell a long way and hit the ground so hard I sort of exploded. And my aw super awesome enchanted diamond helmet fell into some lava. And that was highly highly pants and so we had been I I wore this this chain helmet of derpitude out of shame and I think it's time to take the scarlet letter off so before we get over go over to the library I'm gonna do some enchanting real quick and I always want to kind of show the the entranceway going into this room because it's so cool. Actually, this room's pretty cool too. I still really like the design in here. But what I'm really talking about is the entranceway into our enchanting station. The way the glow kind of comes up from the floor and you get that view way down there and then the dimly lit enchanting station over there. Oh, I just, I love this build. This build was so much fun. I'm absolutely glad we did it. It was an awful lot of work for an enchanting station. I mean, we dug a huge hole just for that. But <laughs> if you're not going to go to ridiculous lengths to build something cool, why are you playing Minecraft? All right, so let's let's see what we got. And actually, once again, I've herped and I've derped. I don't have any loppies with me. I'm going to go get that, and we'll be right back. Okay, looks just as cool the second time. Ah, I love this room. I love this room so much. And this time I actually remembered the loppies. Go me. All right. Oops, wrong button. Let's let's try this out. Put some loppies there. And then we want a good helmet first off. So let's see what we got. Aqua Affinity. I've already got an Aqua Affinity helmet. <sighs> Aqua Finney sucks. Because I don't need more than one Aqua Affinity helmet. I've got one I'm holding back for when we end up going into the Guardian area, into the Sunken Temple. Alright, so let's see what else we got. Ooh, maybe we can have some Infinity. How about some in Flame? I also have Flame. Uh, flame's not bad. We may end up taking that. Okay, come on, Schwartz. Come on, Schwartz. Feather Falling 4. Ooh. You know what? I think we're going to take the boots. And I guess we're going to have to continue wearing the chain. Wow, would you look at that? Uh, the projectile projection, eh. But the depth strider and feather falling, that's pretty good. I've got depth strider on my current pair of boots. Let's take a look. Do I? Yeah, just depth strider three, though. Um, my, my new pair got the feather falling and had I had the feather falling on my boots when I was doing all that I might still have my super cool helmet instead of that that ridiculous looking thing all right well anyway now let's talk about what we're gonna do today okay recently I know I've been soliciting comments on these lamp posts in particular and on this entranceway, particularly those pillars and that swath of regular smooth sandstone back there. And I am I do want to hear them. However, I'm recording this very, very early in into my normal recording cycle. And I'm doing that because well, I can just go ahead and tell you. I'm traveling some and 
I will actually have returned by the time you guys see this video, but I am traveling while during my normal recording time. So I'm getting that out of the way. So I'm not ignoring your comments. I just haven't seen them as of the recording of this video. Okay. So yeah, this, 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 this library, I, I told you before I'm sick of the designer's block. I am not going to be beaten by my own Minecraft creation. So I still have no idea exactly what I'm putting in here, but I know the general layout. I'm going to do a two level thing. So this floor that you can access from up here is going to be as high as, as this is, and it's going to run over to the side there. And that's, that's super. And then we're also going to have a second level that will actually go down into. Um, so it'll get sunk a little bit lower. I don't know how much room we have to play up, play with when we go down and I don't care. I'm just, I'm done with, uh, <laughs> having my butt kicked by this build. Oh, I don't know what it was about it. I, this, this chunk of rock right here has caused me so much just design stress and you know what? That's it. I'm done with it. It is time to, 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 to get going on it. Just get something in. I have to tell you guys, I don't think we're going to get terribly far in today's episode. Uh, I had mentioned earlier that I'm going to be traveling, and I have been tra double, basically doubling up on my recording time. So I've been hitting it really hard lately, getting out episodes for Seven Days to Die and for Minecraft. And I am right on the tail end of that recording time, so... I don't think we're going to be able to make this quite as in depth as most episodes go, but I think it's still going to be a good one. We're, we're working on this. We're getting it cleared out. I don't know what we're not certainly not going to get to a final design today, but we are certainly going to at least get a layout put in. Ah, oh, man, this, this build, I tell you. Okay. And actually while I'm digging this out, I'm going to go ahead and throw out a plug for my other series. You know, I don't know how everybody stands on the whole zombie theme, which is really kind of overdone. But my other series, which is another Let's Play for uh, a game called Seven Days to Die. It's an alpha. Uh, it's an alpha stage game. So it's still under development. It's still got plenty of bugs and stuff to work out. But I bought early access to it through Steam, and it is being a lot, a lot of fun. And I'm having a blast doing it, and I think the, the episodes are, are pretty fun as well. And so I encourage you to check that out. It's, it's a pretty neat game. It's a kind of combination first-person zombie shooter with, oh, I don't know, like some tower defense and even a little Minecraft kind of thrown in. There's an extensive crafting system, and you end up or at least I usually end up building my own base and uh, trying to make it strong enough so that when the seven day hordes show up, you know, I survive because that's kind of the whole point of a zombie survival game. Uh, so I really encourage you guys to check that out. Uh, it's, you know, on my channel, check it out. Tell me what you think. As always, I love hearing comments and questions and all that good stuff down in the comment section. We have a visitor to our library. Let's hit him with the sword. No, you are not taken. No, you are not. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, bookshelves take a lot of resources to make, and I didn't feel like having some jerk face Enderman steal one of mine. So we've got this top area cleared out, and a picture's kind of starting to come to mind. Uh, like I said before, I don't know that we're going to get it to it all today but I think what we're going to do is we're going to wrap the bookshelves around this way they'll probably stop somewhere right around here because this is going to be our stairway up huh or because that's I just had a second thought okay because we've already got this stairway that'll make it up to here 
what if this, instead of going up, goes down? Then we could actually work in the second level. I don't know. Mm, 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 mm. I don't know. Design decisions, guys. Design decisions. Because I, I like the feel of this. I don't know why, but I just like the feel of that kind of going up. And you come up into here and you turn around and you've got a, you know, got a wall of bookshelves. And I think I'm probably going to be doing like tables around here, like tables and chairs, so like, you know, desks for studying at and things like that. Huh, 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 huh. But if I do stick with this, then one of the problems I run into is what do I do with this great big chunk here? There should be, and I've got a couple ideas I can do. I mean, I can do like a glass enclosure and then, you know, put some grass blocks in there, light it up and put like some flowers in there for some kind of, what is that? Like a topiary or I think that's the word. I don't know. I, I don't know the word. So, huh? huh, 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 huh. Uh, either way, it could be cool. I mean problem with going down there is it gets kind of you drop down to there and you've got this kind of more underground feel to it and you know we've done that a lot in here already we really have because we did the kind of like archive study area here uh, and it's all very dark and gloomy down here we made sure that when we uh half slab it so no monsters would appear and then we didn't light it up so and I do think it works and then if you really want gloom check out the well these are the archives down here and this turned out really well I like this a lot so you know I don't know that I want to do you know more of the same kind of subterranean storage gloomy thingy dealy thingy dealy is a technical mind minecraft term you can look it up in the manual if there were a manual to look it up in okay yeah so we, oh well thanks guys you just talked me into it we're gonna we're gonna stick with this for now and i'm gonna figure out something something fancy schmancy to do in there i don't know when i'm gonna figure that out but uh <laughs> but no now we have a plan then one other thing I have to figure out in that plan, what am I doing here? Huh. Do you guys want to talk about another design consideration right now? No, we'll talk about it later. All right, we're going to have to check our light source. I didn't think it was, there was enough spa spot, or uh, I thought there was enough light right there to keep uh, baddies from spawning, but I'll have to check that out while I shoot this guy like in his noggin. Okay, what it... There we go. Wee! <laughs> we didn't really have that much room to work with. Um, because that right there is the ceiling to our archive. So, yeah, we didn't... <laughs> we didn't have much room to fool around. But anyway, let's get this in here. And here I'm just trying to get into the design where the uh, the bookcases turn the corner. I've also added in just this little walkway up. I'm not exactly sure how we're gonna transition it in. I'm gonna take I'm gonna bring the bookcases over first, and then we'll work this work the pathway into them. All right, I think I heard a skeleton clanking around in here somewhere. So let's find him and hit him with a sword. And really, I just want to make sure that I haven't let a spot in here get to the point where it can get a monster to spawn in it. I just, you know, if one makes it in from the outside, that takes a lot of work for it. That's fine. I'll deal with that. But, all right, I don't see him in here, so he must be outside. That's good. So we're going to have to kind of wrap it up there, I think. I am just absolutely out of time. But I did want to talk about 
I had forgotten how much I liked this shelf design, this this library design in general. I like the way the colors work together. Oh, it just, I'd forgotten how much I liked it. It just, it had really been that long since we worked on, any, on anything in here. Because that stupid designer's block. But this is coming along nicely. We've got the stairway in and we'll do something with the walls eventually I'm sure um, so yeah no this is a good start this is great so thank you guys for tuning into this episode of the casually avid gamer plays Minecraft I hope you enjoyed this I hope you had fun I'm sorry I have to apologize for the more truncated episode today like I said it just I'm out of time I was record I was doing double duty on recording this weekend and I'm just out of time but either way I hope you enjoyed it I know I enjoyed making it for you if you did enjoy it please click that like button or click that subscribe button whatever you want to do it's all good I hope you guys have a great week and we'll talk to you next time mm -hmm.